Hello and welcome to the Using the Import Wizard video. To demonstrate importing, we're going to import the accounts test CSV file. To begin the importing process, select Import Accounts in the Accounts module menu. This starts the importing wizard. In our case, we're going to choose our file, which is accounts test dot csv and in our case our records are brand new so we're going to leave the option that says create new accounts only and click next step two of the wizard confirms your import file properties so you can see here displayed several rows in your csv file with the header row the information looks correct, so we don't need to change any of our file properties. We're also not importing from Salesforce or Outlook, so we're going to leave the option at None and select Next. This page is where we confirm our field mappings, the fields that are in our CSV file to the fields that are in Sugar. So the very first field is company and that automatically mapped to name and that's correct so we're going to leave that. Street address, we're going to change that to Billing Street. City to Billing City. State to Billing State. Zip code to Billing Postal Code. Phone office to office phone. Website to company website. We're also going to add a new field. In our case, we're going to assign all of these records to a specific user. So we're going to select Assigned Username, and instead of Sarah, we want them to be assigned to Will. And you can add additional fields if you wish. We're going to click Next. In this step, step 4, this is where we can check for duplicates. So if there are records already within Sugar, we can verify that those records don't already exist. So we need to select a field that's very unique, like email address or name. So I'm going to simply drag that over to Fields to Check. And then also I want to save these settings because this is just the test file. I'm going to do this import again with all my records, so I don't want to have to redo the mapping again. So I'm just going to call this Accounts, and then Import Now. And there's only five records in our CSV file, so it's imported all five records successfully. It's even given me a list of those five records at the bottom of the screen. If there were duplicates or errors found, it would display them on the Duplicates or Errors tab. I can undo this import. I can import again using the same mapping, or I can exit. If I select Exit, the imported records will display at the top of the Accounts module list view. And that's how easy it is to do an import. Now that we've walked through using the Import Wizard, you should be able to import your data into Sugar. Thanks for watching.